Good morning, everyone. Granny here. Praise God, y'all. One day closer to going home. One day closer, y'all. Praise God. Haven't done a video in a while, y'all. I know. I've uh, been kind of stepping back. I'm uh, uh, just trying to walk closer with the Lord and doing a lot more praying and a lot more listening. So I'm doing this video today, and I'm probably, uh, if I can figure out how, I'm going to turn off the comments because I don't want to argue with anybody. Um, uh, too many people bring in argumentative spirits, and I'm telling you, I'm just not cut out for that. I wanted to do videos on my testimony. My whole purpose of doing videos was to get my testimony out there and tell everybody how the Lord worked in my life. It ended up me talking more about the rapture, for so, and I think that was because somebody disagreed with my, my dream. <laughs> uh, you know, you're not allowed to dream anything but what they want you to dream, and it has to be scriptural, or they will just go crazy. So, <laughs> uh, it might, that's the way my, my first video was done on a, a rapture dream, because I was questioning God about the rapture, you know, I, I didn't know enough about it, and, you know, I wondered if the rapture was even going to happen, so God gave me a rapture dream, and I haven't questioned the rapture since, and so I started out with that, with that video, and then you know, the rest of my uh, videos after that were uh, my testimonies about how the Lord worked in my life. And I guess I was hoping that they would bless others and help others and do for others, you know, and, and, and help others. But you got those few, and, and it makes it bad because there are so many of you who had nothing but good things to say, and y'all are wonderful people and and everything, but the the few that want to get in here and they bring in an argumentative spirit because they carry an argumentative spirit and they have to argue with everything, you know, because they're religious. They're just religious. Uh, everything has to meet their standards and they feel like they own your video and they have to tell you what to do with your video and they own YouTube and they have to tell you what to do. So they get on here and they want to argue. And they bring in their argument. The thing about it is, folks, if you listen to a video of someone telling what they believe, they're talking about what they believe in. And if you listen to it and you disagree with it, normally I would just click off of it and move on to something else. But these people that carry this argumentative spirit have to get on here and comment how, oh, this just ain't right. You're wrong, and you're wrong, and you're wrong. And they bring in that argumentative spirit, and they want you to argue. And you find yourself trying to convince this person while they're trying to convince you. They already know they can't convince you of the way they believe. They already know this. But they still want to argue about it, and they want to carry it on, and they carry it on. And I find this is stealing my joy away. And I will not let these people that carry these argumentative spirits with them, these religious people who carry these argumentative spirits with them, I will not let them steal my joy away. I will stop doing these videos altogether before I let that happen. And I will turn off the comments altogether before I let that happen. Now, I said I, I'm not quitting, but I am going to wait till the Lord tells me to do videos. I'm I'm waiting for him to give me what to say to, to give me to come and tell me that I that I need to do videos because I want it to be from the Lord, not from me, you know, and I want to know for a fact it's from the Lord. And unless he gives me a dream or comes and tells me, Valerie, I want you to do a video about this, you know, or hopefully the rapture will happen first. And we'll get to go home. The good thing about it is, is I can talk about the rapture in this video. And nobody can disagree with me. You can't come against me. And the funny thing is, is when you talk about the rapture, and you make a video about the rapture, this person that's watching this video automatically knows that you believe in the rapture. And they automatically know your belief in the rapture. Sorry, y'all. I had to let my dog in. 
And they automatically know your belief in the rapture. And they automatically know what you believe in the rapture. So if they don't believe in it, then why do they sit and watch? And why do they feel like they have to comment? Why not just move on? Because there's no way they can convince me there's not going to be a rapture. And there's no way I can convince them that there is going to be a rapture. So why argue with it? It's because you have an argumentative spirit. And you are carrying this argumentative spirit around with you. And you want to argue with these people. And you want to argue with people. So you'll find anything. I'm telling you, it's so bad. On my, on my community board, I put up a song. <laughs> and this is a song that came out around the 80s, I believe it was. It was in the 80s it came out. And and, and it's a beautiful song. And, it, and it's my allegiance song. It's, I pledge that allegiance every day. Every day I pledge that allegiance to the Lamb of God. And I posted the lyrics on my community board. It's so bad. It's gotten so bad, y'all. And it, it, this is just the beginning. It's going to get worse. I posted this lyrics to this song on my community board. And this person with this argumentative spirit, this religious person with an argumentative spirit, decided to get on. It's a sin to, to repeat word, repetitive words. It's a sin. Oh, my Lord. Only thing I could comment was, wow. That was, it was a song from back in the 80s. And, and, uh, only thing I could say was, wow. And when they went after Mr. Ponstein, Ponstein, I think is his name. I, I, I think it's Mr. Ponstein. Anyway, Mr. Ponstein's been nothing but kind to me on here. He's always had kind words to say, and, and, and most of the time he cheers me up with his words. And when they went after him, that's when I had enough. That's when, y'all people, that's when I had enough. You're going after people that's had nothing but good things to say. I've seen it happen on the last video I had where somebody brought in their argumentative spirit. You know, telling me, uh, let's see, I forgot what that was over. Oh, that was because I was being a hypocrite because I delete comments that disagree with me. <laughs> and, you know, that was on my last video. I deleted that video. I got rid of it. But they went after Miss Peggy Lee. Miss Peggy Lee's just a sweet lady. I just love her. I, I, you know, just had nothing but sweet things to say and went after her. These argumentative spirits, and this this is what did it for me. I I'm not going to let them come in here and abuse the, the people that that are are just kind hearted and sweet. And Mr. Ponstein didn't say anything bad. He just told them they needed to apologize because they were being mean to someone else on there. Someone else that that was trying to tell them that it was a song, you know, and and it, it just. <laughs> That right there just blew it with me. You're religious. You people carrying your religious argumentative spirits, you need to back off. Nobody wants to hear from you, okay? If you don't believe what I'm, what I'm on here doing a video about, move on to something else. Go to another video. If somebody's doing a video that you don't believe in, move on to something else. Pray to God to deliver you from and completely clear you of that argumentative spirit. You don't need that argumentative spirit. And you'll find that you want to argue less. Okay? I don't want to argue about nothing. You know? But things like the rapture, some believe in the rapture. So I'm okay with the ones that don't believe in the rapture. I'm fine with that. I wish they did. But I'm okay with them not believing in the rapture. You don't have to believe in the rapture for your salvation. You're right. You don't have to believe in the rapture for your salvation. But I would like for you to go with us when it's time to go. Those that don't believe in the rapture, and I'm saying it. This, that's what I believe. That those that don't believe in the rapture will be tribulation saints. Obviously, they're looking for the tribulations. They're not looking for the rapture. How are you going to find something that you can't see and you're not looking for it? So I, I don't know. I might be wrong. I'm praying about that now because I want, I don't want to be wrong and I don't want to get on here and do a video 
and be wrong about something. So I'm praying over that now. That's what I believe right now at this very moment. I will pray over it. I will do exactly what you said. I will pray over it and ask the Lord about that. Do people that don't believe in the rapture and that totally doesn't believe in the rapture, will they see the rapture? Personally, I don't think you see things that you're not looking for. I don't know. I, I'm praying over that one. I know I had, in my dream, when I dreamed about the rapture, I had two, two dreams in one dream. I dreamed about the rapture, and I went in the rapture, and then I woke up in, still in the dream where I got left behind in the rapture. So I got a taste of both of them. And in the second one, when I got left behind, I knew exactly what was going on, the commotion that was going on. I knew exactly what was going on because I had heard about it and I just dreamed about it. And I said, that's the rapture. I know that's the rapture. But the man grabbed me by the arm. This old man grabbed me by the arm and says, you can't go. And I'm like, why can't I go? Why can't, what did I do wrong? But I had to stay. And I was going to be killed, not just killed, but tortured. They were talking about torturing me. So that was the second part of my dream. So I don't know. I'll pray about it again. But my belief, and I've always believed, if you're not looking for the rapture, you won't see the rapture. But I'm not going to say that anymore until I know for a fact that that's right. You know, I'm like I said, I'm going to let the Lord tell me what and when to do a video and what to say on a video if I do any more videos it'll be a dream he's given me or whatever and I'm not gonna leave the comments up because I just ain't I ain't dealing with I'm not dealing with no more argumentative spirits I'm done with you and I rebuke you our argumentative spirits in Jesus name I'm not dealing with them anymore so anyway uh I'll still put things on the comment board, and y'all can comment uh, and put in your prayer request. I'm still praying for all these people on this list. I do every night, and I'm still doing it. Uh, Miss Lady Jess and and uh, uh, Miss Cindy Barnes, and uh, I think Miss Cindy Barnes put a prayer request yesterday about her pains and uh, uh, dealing with pains and stuff, and uh, so, you know, we're still praying over this list and, and, and I'm not going to stop praying over the prayer list. I pray to, I pray to God over this prayer list every night and I ask God to take care of each and every one of you. In fact, I, I prayed last night for each and every one of y'all, all my viewers, even the ones that disagree with me, even the ones that carry an argumentative spirit. I even prayed for y'all because that's just the way, that's what I do. That's how I roll. I pray for everyone, and I and and you know I care. I try to love everyone, and I know that I come off kind of strong sometimes, but I, I'm a sensitive person. I really am, and I and I don't have the tough skin like some people get on here, and they just don't pay any attention to the bad comments, you know. And I, and I went and 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 listened to uh, uh, Crystal Love for Christ. I listened to her the other day and she was doing a video and she was talking about uh, people who uh, are sleeping with their boyfriends and all this kind of stuff and talking about how they will not go. You need to do right. You need to do right. You know, you cannot be committing uh, fornication or, you know, it, it, you need to be doing the right thing. You know, you can't be sleeping with your boyfriend. You need to, you need to be right. And I went back and looked to see how many bad comments she got. I didn't see any. Unless she's deleting them, <laughs> I didn't see any bad comments. I said, they're just coming after me. So I, I, I don't know. Maybe she gets them. And she deletes them or maybe she hides them or whatever. I don't know. Uh, I, have, I, I just don't have as thick a skin as everyone else. And I don't know how to you know, do all these fancy things that they do on the, on the, um, 
uh, YouTube thing, you know, I wish I, I wish I had a way to do fancier things and, and I wish I even had a way to had guests on so I could talk to guests. Maybe the good Lord will make that happen for me, you know, I don't know. So, but meanwhile, it's just been like this. It's been like this and, and, uh, I'm going to see. If I could turn the comments off on this, if I don't, I'll figure it out. So I just uh, uh, don't want no argument to spirits. Don't want to deal with them. I'm sorry. I'm rebuking them. If you rebuke them, they will flee. So it's I'm probably going to lose. I'm not even looking at that anymore. I, I'm not even looking at the numbers anymore, but I'll probably lose subscribers and that's okay. Because I've done videos on this and I was told that I was wasting people's time. I'm, I, I definitely won't do that no more. <laughs> so um, I'm going to pray for these people real quick. And and then I'm going to move on and, and pray to God and see where he wants to take me from here. So Sandra uh, uh, needs big prayers for healing and, and other things. So we're praying for for her. Uh, JC returns for me to uh, prayers for pain and, and husband's surgery. So we're praying for you. And Cindy Barnes, like I said, is going through a lot of pain. And we need to pray for her. Pray for her. And, and we're still praying for all these, all these names. I mean, I've got this book full of names, y'all. Uh, full of names. Uh, Jody and children, you know, I'm praying for my brother and his family. Uh, uh, Bridget Hall, we're still praying for you and your daughters and uh, everybody and just praying for all of y'all. And I'm, I'm going to continue praying for, for this list. I pray, I pray for it every night and I, I said I would and, and I, I'm a woman of my word. I stick to my word. And you can count on that. So let's pray for these folks real quick and give it to God. Dear Lord, I bring this list to you with all these names on it. And I ask you, Lord, to to uh, please bless these people, Lord, and let your will be done in them, Lord. Uh, healing for the ones that need healing, Lord, and calmness for the ones that need calm and, and relief for the ones that are in pain, Lord. There's so many in pain, Lord. And and relief for the ones that are in financial stress, Lord. And we ask you, Lord, to meet their needs and, and help them, Lord. And let your will be done in them, Lord. And we thank you, Lord, for all that you do. We thank you for being in our lives, Lord, and saving us from our sins. We thank you for all that you do. And we look forward to spending our eternity with you in your kingdom. And we thank you, Lord. In the name of our Lord Jesus Christ, I pray. Amen. I want to thank y'all for listening to me. Thank y'all for being uh, big supporters of this channel. Thank y'all for all that you do, uh, praying for people. And I'm sorry that I'm turning off the comments, and I'm sorry that it's ending this way. But, you know, it's like I said, I'll I'll do comments again. I mean, I'll do uh, uh, videos again, but uh, I just... I got to grow some thicker skin and I'm just not cut out for uh, all these argumentative spirits. So if I flee away from them, if I rebuke them and just be, you know, uh, it's like I said, I've been accused of so many things on here. I've been accused of trying to make money. I've been accused of being evil. I've been accused of, uh, being a hypocrite, I've been accused of being a self-righteous person, I've been accused of so many things, it's just not even real, and, you know, they, I don't understand why they just don't, uh, just move on to another channel, why they have to bring on the argumentative spirit, why they want, want to argue, but they do, and it's not going to stop. No matter what I do, I can't even post a song on the uh, lyrics to a song on the on my community board without an argumentative spirit wanting to bark at me like little chihuahuas. So <laughs> I'm done with it. I'm tired. I'm gonna go walk with God. I'm gonna go walk with the. I'm gonna go walk closer with the Lord, 
and listen better and maybe he will have me come back and be even better at this so i love y'all i'm uh like i said I, i'm dealing with a lot of a lot of things also uh they've got me doing a lot of tests now i i, I don't know if they're like concerned about something or they're just going to keep going with me until they find something you know i tried to tell my doctor that uh, the other day when I went to see my doctor, I tried to tell her, you know, I, you know, I dodged the bullet, you know, I did. And she says, well, I want to make sure, you know, so they're sending me to all these things and having all these tests run on me. So to make sure, and they're a little worried about the nodule that they found in my lung, but I'm not too worried about it. I was kind of wanting to go home, but you know, whatever, I'll just let them keep looking. So Anyway, thank y'all for your prayers. Thank y'all for all that you do. I love you, but God loved you first. And thank y'all for watching.